No, mine is not as good. <laughs> mine is like, okay. Faith in yourself. Uh, I am blessed to have you not only as my wife but as my friend. You are easily the best thing that's ever happened to me. The past two years of marriage have been amazing and it's just the beginning of our beautiful journey together. This vow renewal is a new chapter in our lives and we get to make a new we get to make new promises that we will hold for the rest of our marriage. You have changed me for the better, and I truly believe that if I never met you, I would not be the man I am today. I was lost until, I, until God put you in my life. I knew I wanted to marry you since we were freshmen in high school. All I thought about was you. I was so excited to graduate high school because I knew if we made it through those four years, that we would get married and spend the rest of our lives together. <laughs> Along the way, uh, people made it seem crazy that we us getting married so young, but I always knew that we were gonna prove them wrong and we would be an example of what a marriage should look like. And then when we're old and wrinkly, we could look back and say, we've been married for 70 plus years and had the best life together. Our journey has truly been perfect and I couldn't have asked for a better life. I have no worries about us as I know our marriage will be led in faith. Ephesians 5 verse 25, it says, Husbands, love your wives just as Christ loved the church and gave himself up for her. I promise to follow this scripture with all my heart. I promise to honor and protect you. I promise to be the strong spiritual leader for us in our life. And I promise to love you and choose you forever until death is part. <laughs> Matthew, Stephen, and Grissel. I can't believe it's been two years already. What an amazing thing to celebrate. I'm so proud of us. Navigating marriage as teenagers up until now has not been an easy task, but it has been so rewarding. I can't believe I get to grow up with you and be loved by you. I'm so honored to be your wife. I want to thank you for being so patient for me, with me and thank you for putting others before yourself. You have such a servant's heart and really so many incredible qualities that I hope I'll be able to emulate someday. We have failed each other so often and I know that we'll fail each other in the future, but I promise to forgive you like Jesus does us daily. And I promise to practice understanding and compassion with your struggles and shortcomings. I promise to lift you up and to always stand by you. I've learned that we won't always feel like loving each other, but I reinstate my vow to choose to love you when it's hard to. We have so much left to learn about each other and so much about ourselves will change, but I'm not worried about who we will be at 25 or beyond that because my love for you will never waver and my choice to love you will not change. I love you so much. <laughs>
I'm so nervous. Okay. Like we're getting ready again. I know.